Hey everyone, the Market Center has gone virtual. So what does that mean for you and your upcoming closings? First, if you haven't completed a direct deposit form, send me an email so I can send it over to you. You can also find the form in the file section in the internal Facebook page on the left-hand side. I just need your bank name, routing, and account numbers, but I do not need a copy of avoided check. We cannot, press your, we cannot process your closings without this form. Also, send an email to the title company requesting copies of the closing doc and closing check. You will upload these in your opportunity. If you have the physical check, please keep for your records. If you are taking a picture of the check to upload, make sure you're using a PDF scanner such as Genius Scan or Cam Scanner. JPEG pictures upload really poorly and it makes it hard for us to process those transactions. I've emailed the local title companies that are currying over checks and let them know we have set up a combo lockbox on the front door with a key fob they can use to access the office and drop off the documents. If there's a title company you work for that I haven't sent this email to, please send me over an email and I can get that to them. Once your opportunity is 100% compliant, send me an email with the opportunity ID and property address so I can process your check through. That means when all three folders say have the green approved sign, I'll be able to go in, print your check off, process the transaction through, and deposit the check using our check scanner. Direct deposit normally takes one business day before it hits your account. When your transaction has been processed, I'll send you a check scub so you know which transactions are being deposited into your account. If you need anything during this time, please don't hesitate to reach out to anyone on the executive team. We're here to serve you.